Hey, YouTube, what's up? I got a yabo. It's from nothing other than Pole Climber 1985. Brandon. Right on, buddy. I am very pleased that I was able to do this transaction with you. Some of you may have seen uh, Brandon's uh, video. If you haven't, you'll have to wait for me to show you what I got. Anyway, get this open here. With some of this in it. Brigader Black, Alamo Automatic, Aromatic. And I forgot who gave me a whole bunch of these samples. I forgot. And I wrote it on a couple of the bags, but not on this one. Sorry. But I bet you you'll know who you are when you see that bag. But let's get on with the Yabo. More than the pipe. More than the pipe. And you know, I was just thinking, I forgot what the name of this is. Go figure. And I got some backy too. Ooh. Three Oak Syrian. Good stuff. Good stuff. Look at that. How generous is that? Had a sample. Had a good sample of this actually. And it's excellent. Thank you, Brandon. do know had to look twice because you thought it might have been a bulk of it huh he's got the same type bags but only with his signature this one Joe Case let me get it pretty for you This is a beauty. Wow. Nice. 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 Okay. Like I said, those of you that seen the video know what it is. Those of you that didn't, I'll show you. I have a Sleepy Hollow, I believe. Um, I believe that came from Pat Pope. Um, and I think I got some other pipes off Joe that he was downsizing his collection that he didn't use in his uh, rotation. And I've been wanting to visit his site, but he's got a waiting list and, you know, just one thing after another and with me. And finally the opportunity arose at the right time. Hmm. I believe it's some kind of 
Slayer Poker, I thinking. Slayer Poker, I think. One day I'll do one with some better lighting. This stem is like a swirl, or a, it's a nice, it's silver, or whatever you see in there, the shiny parts. Showcase on the bottom, smooth bottom. I think it's the Slayer Poker, I believe. Nice pipe. Love it. Thank you, Brandon. Uh, it's kind of, everybody's kind of sleeping right now, so I'm kind of being quiet. Look at the ring on that thing. I love the, the, the band. Nice. I think it's the traditional band he uses, I think. That's nice. Um, also, I'm going to squeeze in a another Yapo that I got from Calendarl. Um, we talked a while back. Um, he has a, a berry tree. It's some kind of berry. And he did some research and he found out that a long time ago, whenever, I don't know how long ago, but they used that berry for a, a stain, I believe, or coloring of woods or whatever. So I was talking with them, you know, in a message on YouTube, and I had said that would be cool to do a pipe. So he offered to send me some of the berries, and I'm going to sand down a briar pipe and uh, stain it with that, and then uh, carnauba wax it, and uh, see how that does it with the natural coloring of that berry. So that's what we talked about but this package seems a little big and it seems heavier than a couple berries to do so I didn't think Brandon would mind if I jumped in and uh, threw this yabo in because I gotta get up early and I wanted to get these up because I like getting them up for you guys as soon as possible you guys took the time, went down and mailed it. I could take the time to do a yabo in a yabo. Wow. Okay. Look at all this. Mr. Calendarl, you're a gentleman. Here's some beeswax hemp and some Virginia tobacco seeds oh plus a, li a little of that name I forgot Fenaganippe or something is the name of the berry I believe uh, and tobaccos some walnut tobacco walnut I believe these are the this is the tub tobacco of the walnut over the counter I believe I don't have any I have the Prince Albert and I have the other tub forgot what they are but I don't have the walnut I want to try that one yes that is nice and we have Dark Strong. Dark Strong had a sample of this. This is very good. I think I just smoked the last. It was in my jar. So I got to restock. That's cool. And hemp. I just, I had, uh, I'm going to do a different video uh, here soon. Uh, but I went to the West Coast Pipe Show. And uh, what brought me to mind of this when I seen this was. I got some matches from there and I've been using matches. So I was thinking, huh, oh, these will go good with matches. Hemp wick.
cool. Last hemp wicks I had, I got off eBay and then I sent them all out to uh, to, to people I was sending yabos to, because it's like it's kind of weird for me to get used to lighting a match to light a hemp wick. It just seems like double work, but I'm weird that way. So I'm gonna give it another shot, and there's quite a bit on here too, and it's cleaner smoke and stuff like that. No sulfur, no you know how that goes. Anyway, and I believe. These are the, the berry seeds. Let me get to them so I can show you. I tell you, I do this off the cuff. Never prepare, do it on the spot. I don't prep my elbows. So. This or this or this or. Oh, here it is. Yeah, these Virginia seeds are the seeds that, uh, the seeds that, uh, Is this a closed tin tobacco? Maybe these are the seeds. I'm so confused. Virginia seeds. I think these are from his plant to plant tobacco. I'm going to have to check it. I thought the, the berry seeds were in here. Anyway. I'm going to have to find out and see what's what. This feels heavy and it's not opening. I think it's a sealed tin. Another Yapo gone bad, peoples. On my part. I wasn't expecting these seeds, but these are Virginia seeds. But I, we talked about a uh, blue or a berry. Virginia tobacco, uh, hemp lighting, beef oil. Mm -hmm. Unless these are them, but it says Virginia seeds, so I'm gonna have to get with Calendar and see if um, cause this ain't open and it like looks like it got the suction still. Okay, well, I'll get with. I mean, he sent way more than we. I was just expecting a bag of seeds like this um, from his blue, from a bush that does these blue seeds. Unless that bush is gone now, but I got Virginia seeds, so I'm gonna have to see what's up. Calendar, Brandon. I'm going to put the links below. If you haven't subbed to these guys, give them a sub. And I will definitely get back on here. i got to do a video, and I want to kind of talk about uh, who I met at the pipe show um, and my feelings on the pipe show. I uh, didn't get no pictures. Uh, I left early, and... Uh, kind of went bad after we left so look forward to that all is good but it's quite a story anyway YouTube Brandon Calendar thank you my peoples appreciate the yabos and yapos and I will see you on the next video take care bye now